Whoa, DT, what are those cool cars over there? Can we go see? Sure thing, Jax. But remember, we can't take anything that is not ours. Not without permission, at least. Yes, DT, of course. Don't worry, I'm a good boy. <laughs> Very good. Now, let's go check out those toy cars. All the cars are getting set. Ladies and gentlemen, we're all gearing up for an exciting race. Four laps to decide the winner. It's a race to the finish, ladies and gentlemen. Fasten your seatbelts. Quick, kids, get to the leaderboard score. Oh, there's no time. When I scream out the number, put it up on the board. There. Hey! What, what are we supposed to do? Oh, DT, the commentator has asked us to hang the correct number of the car when she tells us, but we're not sure how to do it. Don't worry, kids. All you have to do is use these for the number at the tens place and put these for the ones place on top of it. And 53, and lap one belongs to car 53. Wow, this is exciting. <laughs> okay, kids, I'll help you with the first lap. For 53, we have one, two, three, four, five. Five tens should make 50. And there are three ones, which means five tens plus three ones, which should be 53. 53! <laughs> All right, DT. Looks like we got it. And lap two belongs to car 60 as he beautifully takes the lead. Quick, Jane, number 60. Um, so six tens means six zero. Sixty. And no ones means, uh, oh, yes. Just this then. All right. Things are going smooth for car 60 and, oh, wait! Oh, what an incredible lead by car 87 as he goes for the lead. Oh, oh, 87. Oh, that means there are eight tens and seven ones. So this goes here, 80, and this on top of that, seven, so 87. The final lap, ladies and gentlemen. It's looking very close. Car 93 has been slower than usual, but he's known to pick up in the end. Oh, car 93, car 93, reaching the finish line and, oh my, look! We have our final lap winner, car 93. Oh, nine tens, 90. And three ones, so 93. As you can see the scoreboard for the final lap results, Thank you, children, for your help. <laughs> oh, that's okay. We had fun doing this anyway. Oh, that was good, kids. You were really quick. Good stuff. <laughs> Thanks, DT. But I have one question, DT. When we were setting the car up, why couldn't we just pick a seven card and a five card and put them together for 75? Why the seven tens card with the five ones card? Ooh, now that is a smart question, Jane. Now, you see, when I have a 70 arrow card, I know that I have seven tens already. The zero in 70 holds a place for the number of ones that I could have in this number. Now, to show five ones, I simply put this five card over the zero. Ta-da! I have 75. Seven tens and five ones. Having the zero in the 70 card tells me exactly where the five should go. It should go to the right of the seven. Ah, uh, I understand now. Big numbers are easy too, after all. DT, I have a question too. Like this, we can do all numbers up to 99 now. 99 is nine tens and nine ones. But what if I wanted one more? 
How do I have ten tens? Well, Jax, the number one more than 99, which has ten tens, is called hundred. It is written as one zero zero, a hundred, to show that it has ten tens. It has three digits? Of course, Jane. It has three digits. All numbers that are bigger than 99 have three or more digits. Oh! Looks like another race is going to happen. Would you like to hang back and watch? Baiju's Learning.